Hi, it's Joey from Day Job Hacks. In today's video, I wanna talk about landing pages, how to create a really nice landing pages, and is optimized press better than ClickFunnels? Now you may have heard of ClickFunnels. It's a software program used to create funnels online. It has a monthly subscription where you're paying a lot of money per month. Now I have used it and I think it is a great program but there's a lot of features about it and a lot of things about it that I don't like. Now they have a massive cult-like following. Um, Russell Brunson, I've read a few of his books. In fact, I have the Funnel Hacker package here um, and I find a lot of his tactics are very effective. He can, you know, 10X your business and all that. Very exciting stuff stuff that he has going on over there. However, I think the software itself, the ClickFunnels software, I've used it um, a little overpriced. In fact, they pay their affiliates 50% of monthly commissions on that uh, software. So, I mean, it's 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 kind of an indicative of kind of what is happening over there. It's, it's, it's a software, but you don't have to spend that much money for that type of software. In fact, that's why I wanted to mention Optimize Press. Now, I'm, I'm uh, an affiliate for Optimize Press, let's get that right out of the way. This is going to be a positive review for Optimize Press. I've used it for several years, but again, like I said, I have used ClickFunnels and I know why I chose to go to Optimize Press, okay? Now, Optimize Press uh, is not a monthly subscription. You are buying it, you can buy it once and you can then uh, upgrade every single year if you want. And with that yearly upgrade of I think $179 or roughly anywhere from 179 to 250 I think for the year, you get uh, support and updates with that. Now you don't have to renew every year, you can just keep your original package and you have it for life and you have full control over your website, meaning you take the software and now you have full control over it. Your, your website isn't hosted on another platform like it would be on ClickFunnels where ClickFunnels essentially owns all your, your stuff. And if you ever cancel on ClickFunnels, then you have to kind of migrate everything to wherever you're moving to, okay? I don't really like that idea. Now, the difference between using Optimize Press is you're using WordPress. Now, in the past, WordPress was known to be a clunky platform. You know, it was slow and there's a lot of things with it. But over the years, it's actually really optimized itself. But at the same time, Optimize Press 3.0 has also optimized their templates to make it a faster platform so that you can actually have full control over the speed of your websites and your funnels and you can build out full funnels using Optimize Press 3.0. So that is why I recommend using Optimize Press 3.0. Now there are other tools like funnel, um, th there's uh, lead pages, other tools out there that you can check out but um, this video is going to show how to build a landing page using Optimize Press 3.0 and why I think it is better than ClickFunnels. So let's get into the computer. I'm going to show some of the features about Optimize Press 3.0, how I set it up, how I create a landing page. And this landing page is going to be in the diet niche. I'm actually going to be using this diet niche landing page I create in one of the case studies that I have going on inside Powerhouse Affiliate Premium Members area. Um, if you haven't subscribed there, you go to powerhouseaffiliate.com, sign up for free training, and then you can get access also as a premium member to our case studies where I'm actually going to be driving traffic to this landing page, showing you actual results of how it works, all of the data and that kind of stuff in, inside of our case studies. So just go there now and sign up. And also, you should also subscribe to this channel right now, YouTube, down below. Click the button right here in the video. You can see there's a button here. Click on that to subscribe so you get notified every time I um, get a, a new video out. Yeah, in fact, click the little bell button as well so that it actually tells you when I've, I've created another video. So now let's get into my computer and we're gonna set this page up and then uh, we'll go from there and show you some of the features and pretty much all of the things you can do on ClickFunnels, you can do on Optimize Press 3.0 without the monthly subscription fee, the high costs, and you actually own all of your data and you own your website fully. Okay, so let's go in. All right, welcome to the inside. Now, here is a landing page that I actually created in the past on Optimize Press 2.0 or whatever version it was in the two version of Optimize Press. Now in today's video, I'm gonna do the Optimize Press 3.0, but we're gonna use the same site because this is the site I've used in another case study I used for Facebook where I was trying to run a white hat Facebook campaign 
In that case study, I proved that you can get really cheap leads for diet, and I ran a keto straight sale offer as an affiliate marketer on Facebook. And you can see that entire case study inside, again, Powerhouse Premium. Now, what we're going to do here is I'm just going to log into this WordPress platform. Again, this was built using Optimize Press 2, and now we're going to use Optimize Press 3 and build a landing page using that platform and how I'll set it up here. Now, when I log into my OptimizePress.com account, after purchasing it, you will see that I have a welcome video. It's going to show me all of the information. They have a lot of videos on training here, so that it's great for that. Um, you can pretty much go through um, probably 100 videos here on several pages. Actually, there's 67 videos right now. They're constantly updating this now. Um, as you know every week or two i see some new videos coming up as well as they have a facebook group that you can join um, they're very helpful there as well so let's go in and download the actual piece that we're going to need for wordpress so here is the optimized press dashboard and as well as the builder okay and they also have a theme you can download so i'm going to go ahead and download this one here as well as this one here. And now I'm going to go back into my WordPress dashboard. And in here, I can just upload a plugin. I'm going to take the dashboard here. I will activate. Now you can see here, I can connect with a license. So I'll just connect there. And it's going to ask me to log into my account so it can pull the license from my optimized press and I just click authorize. Now I didn't in fact have to download the plugin because for the builder because it's already here once you put in the dashboard. Um, so that was just an additional step if you wanna have the plugin on your computer. But here you can just click install on the dashboard and then click activate now if you wanted to use their theme as well for your blog posts you could but i'm just going to use my original theme which is on the 25 day keto challenge website and so this won't change my blog post themes at all this is just for building squeeze pages and landing pages and funnels so now what i'm going to do is i'm going to just click here create new page now what i've actually done is i have integrated the Optimize Press 2 here, as you can see, it's still there, but now I have Optimize Press 3, so I'm going to have to do new integrations if I want to collect leads. And what I'm going to be using to collect leads is the autoresponder called AWeber. Now, AWeber is a tool I use. It is a great tool. It helps me manage all my email lists. However, it does come with a price as well. But if you are on a tight budget and you just want to have this platform uh, to build landing pages, then there are some free options out there for autoresponders as well. Uh, check out MailChimp or Sendy is a, a more or less expensive option, but you have to host it yourself. I use AWeber. It's very easy to integrate, but this Optimized Press does integrate with many of the platforms out there that are used for autoresponders, so it's very simple to do. So the first thing I would do is I would just integrate because what I'm going to be building here is a squeeze page because I want to collect the lead first so that I can use it um, to send emails to, build, build traffic on my blog and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to add a new integration here and I'm going to add AWeber. As you can see, there's a ton of other integrations here with um, Optimize Press 3 and they keep adding more as they're continuing to build out this pro uh, this program. And again, they have a lot of history. They've already integrated they've already integrated with many other places on Optimize Press 2. So this is just their new version, which is a, a better, faster, more efficient version of their services. So I'm going to connect that allowed access to I allowed access to Aweber so now you can see I have it it's connected I can disconnect it if I want but now all of my emails that I collect on my squeeze pages will go directly into the list I choose on Aweber which has an autoresponder it will automatically start sending them messages so this is perfect it's quick and easy now creating a new page if I come in here you'll see they have a ton of templates already built they're super nice templates here I love these templates um, they're also in the process of building funnels so you can actually integrate funnels just like you would on um, 
uh, click funnels so a lot of this stuff now you have full access to there's you don't have to go into the click funnel marketplace and buy these these are automatically included and you'll see they have a ton of different ones here now you can also um, I'm sure as the time goes on, they're going to have more. They do that. They did that with Optimize Press 2. Now it's part three. They're starting to every day. You're going to see new templates coming. You'll see they update their Facebook page and group with all the information. So let's just pick a nice squeeze page here. I'm going to be looking for something for leads. So I think they call those landing pages here. So let's have a look at some of them. And I'm going to choose one where I can integrate and get my email capture so that I can use this on my paid ads campaign that we're using in the case study for um, push notification ads. Um, that is in the case study section for the premium members of Powerhouse Affiliate. Okay, so this is the one I'm going to use. It actually fits quite well with Keto Diet right here. I'm going to use this template and I'm going to call it, let's say, Keto Challenge and it's actually a great time for me to be setting this up because the New Year's resolution is coming up. We are in quarter four of this year and we're entering into the hot times for diet products. So I think this is a perfect opportunity now to set this up. Keto challenge, um, and it doesn't really matter at this point. I'm not going for SEO here. I'm just going to set this up. So I'm gonna just call it keto challenge. Creating page. Okay, so now it is loading the elements and we'll just wait for that to happen and then I can start editing and integrating all of this stuff. So to update this stuff, it's really easy. They have a whole bunch of elements up here similar to how ClickFunnels works. You can drag and drop all of these things here. They have countdown timers, evergreen countdown timers, meaning they'll, uh, if somebody leaves your website and comes back later, it'll still uh, be clicking at the same amount of time as what... Um, they they originally said so if it said three days and they come back two days later it'll now say only you know two days left or one day left the countdown timer here you can put like 15 seconds or whatever 30 seconds before this offer expires and it counts down and gives them that sense of urgency now there's a whole bunch of other features here that you can go through uh, i'm not going to go through them all in this video just kind of showing you how it works and you can do that just by simply clicking there. You can add sections as well. So you can see I can add uh, all of these call to actions. Um, I can add uh, email capture forms. And there's also settings. These are similar again to how it works on ClickFunnels, except, you know, like I said, you're not paying your monthly fee. This is now on my WordPress site. It is connected, and now I have full control over all of this. Now, if I wanted to create a funnel right now, you, they don't have the template yet, but you can simply, uh, once you go into your settings here and set up your form, if they enter their email, I have to define the next page they go to. What I would simply do is just come in here and create another page and call it, you know, whatever, step two of my funnel and choose another template. And I can just build out the funnel myself and have a full on funnel that I can tweak and test and, and optimize as we go. And then I can just start duplicating these pages inside Optimize Press, which is a, a cool feature. You can just duplicate pages and they're already built. So moving on, let's just update this. I'm going to say, um, something I'm going to be highly aggressive here because I'm actually using push ads so i really want to get some some high uh the, the, the traffic's really cheap in this case study that i'm using I'm, I'm paying penny clicks but at the same time uh the traffic isn't super um high quality because that's just the way push ads go so i'm going to be uh, highly aggressive because i'm allowed to here and at the same time if i was to do this on facebook i'd have to be a lot more careful in what words I use in terms of setting this up. And that was proven in the last case study on Facebook that I did where we did uh, traffic directly to this page, like I mentioned, which was the 25 day keto challenge. So even this question here was kind of iffy with Facebook. When I said, have you been struggling to get healthy? That was kind of, you know, Facebook was like, wait a minute, you're asking people about their health. Like they don't like that kind of stuff. So you have to be really careful in the wordings you use when you set up ads on Facebook. But again, let's get back because we're actually just trying to build a page here. So let's just go lose 25 pounds fast, whatever, okay? I'm just trying to show you some of the features here. And I can change the name here to whatever I want, you know, created by whoever, Susan Summers, whatever. It doesn't matter. I can uh, change that later. Subscribe to get the new Cravings Collection Cookbook. Now I want to change that to my 25-day 
keto challenge. I'm going to obviously update this a little better. I'm just kind of trying to make this video fast. I don't want to ramble on here about uh, how, all these features because you can see what I'm doing here. So I'm, I'm going to come in later and kind of do real good copy for this. But let's just kind of show you some of the stuff that's going on. And obviously you would update this stuff to your company name or maybe perhaps the year that you're in. And you can also add new sections. But again, let's just go in here. And now what I want to do is I want to activate this form so that it, it actually sends people um, to the next part, which I would have a tripwire offer. And this would be like a an affiliate offer. So I'm going to give them this 25-day keto challenge through email. But as soon as I enter their email, I'm going to send them to a landing page for a keto CPA offer that is kind of you know built to try and convert them. And I actually built that already, as you can see. I'm going to show you that landing page, which was in pages here. And this was built on Optimized Press 2, but it was the day one. This is a landing page I built just for the, as soon as they entered their email on the front page, they came to this, How One Challenge Helped Her Shed 26 Pounds, rambled on about this diet program, about keto, it's a CPA offer. And so this is kind of like the tripwire product that I am pitching as, a, as an affiliate. So what I want to do is I want to buy traffic to this page. I want to get that email and then immediately I want to hammer it with a sale. Okay, I want to get that money back that I paid for those ads. So I'm getting a, a fairly aggressive diet landing page here. Now you can test multiple landing pages here. Now that I have 3.0 installed, I can start using their templates and testing out the next page after somebody subscribes here. So lastly, what I need to do here is I need to uh, make sure it's connected to Aweber, okay? So to do that, I'm going to just click on here, and you'll see up here it has the option for opt-in form. Click on that, and now that you're going to have a little button here called Integration Options. Click on that. You can edit the integration, choose whatever one you want. Of course, I want Aweber here. Next step. Now it's going to ask me to select the list. So I'm going to select the list that I have set up for the 25-day keto challenge. There we go. And then I hit next step. First name, last name, email. Those are the fields I want for this. So I can leave that. Now I'm going to show you how I can change that if I want. I'm going to leave that off for now because I'm targeting the U.S. Um, if I had a global campaign, I would probably show that as well or show it to all visitors. Now I can set the action when the form is submitted. So I can now set up my funnel. Here is where I would put the next page in the funnel. So if I've created part two, which is actually that landing page. Remember, this is the landing page I want to send them to after they subscribe. So this is part of the funnel. I'm going to put that right here. So as soon as they subscribe, they go to day one of the challenge. Okay. Now my email autoresponder will be day two, day three, day three, day four, whatever it is. Right. And that is how I'm going to set this campaign up. So next steps, as you can see, I have this all here and I have this set up on Aweber as a single opt-in. So they're going to go directly to this page. Let's close that up. Now this is all set up. Now I can go through obviously and, and edit all this stuff. I'm just going to show you a couple more things over here. I could change the opt-in form if I wanted over here. They have a few other advanced settings. You can change the positioning. You can make it uh, responsive, all this kind of stuff. Some more advanced stuff for coding. Design, you can change the, the calls to action here as well. I can switch it to that or whatever it is, right? And either way, it's going to automatically switch. And then I just click the Save button up here, and my page is basically ready to go, just like that. Now I can send traffic to this page, collect the email, and they're going into my funnel. And that was all done super fast. 14 minutes it took me to do this. Of course, this page took me some time to build. I can, uh, you know, vouch for that. It probably took me 45 minutes to an hour to build this landing page. But the setup itself, once you have Optimized Press 3.0, it starts to become extremely easy. They have all of the same features um, that you can get on other high paid programs that you're going to be buying. So I like it. You can test the page speed and you can fix things if you have to. You can change the images. You have full control over the build of this page. So that is it for just setting up this landing page. It's a quick option here. Um, you can see I've got a whole bunch of things I need to change, like the headline, the calls to action. These are all very important met, uh, elements of the page that I need to fix. But I can easily do that quickly here now and save it. And then I'm going to start sending traffic in that case study inside the uh, case study section.
All right, so there you have it. That is how I use Optimize Press 3.0. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe to this channel. Also check out Powerhouse Affiliate. As I mentioned, we have case studies, we have free training, and we also do some more training on Optimize Press, uh, using that to build all the affiliate campaigns that are being used in the case studies and traffic lessons. So again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next videos.